another video tutorial by buildthebestwebsite.com. I'm going to be showing you how to build a basic page with front page. And the first thing we're going to want to do is go down here, click on code, and change this new page one to my site name. Okay, and I'm going to go back to design. Now, we're going to go ahead and save this as well. And I'm going to save it. I'm going to create a new folder for it. Call it for build the best website. It's on folder. And we're going to go ahead and save this. Actually, let's go ahead and save it as HTML. Okay. I'm going to close this out because we don't need that. <coughs> now understand that any pictures or backgrounds or anything you use on this page has to be in that same folder. It just makes life much, much better when you go to upload this. FTP it up to your host uh, web uh, account. Um, so <coughs> we're going to start off by inserting a layer. I'm going to drag that over. I'm going to drag it down. And I'm going to go ahead and... Go ahead and pull a picture up. I'm just going to drag it in like that. And that's uh, my little logo. Now, you can move this layer any way you want to. Expand it, drag it, make it bigger, whatever. We're going to kind of put it right there in the center. If I click this right here, it should center it up. Now, I'm going to go ahead and insert another layer. And I'm going to move that one just below this one. And this is where any text I want to put in here is going to be. So you can put okay. <coughs> or you can get all fancy with it and use some uh, some cool fonts. And if I want to change that I'll just select it. Make it bigger, and that's how that works. Now, let's say you have some ads, or you want to put Google AdSense on this page, then you want to go ahead and search you another layer. The cool thing about layers is you can move them around anywhere you want to. You just kind of kind of be careful because sometimes they will overlap. You won't see it right here, so you have to test the page and other browsers. I use Firefox, but usually in front page, if you go to click on Preview, you know. You see, it, it works out pretty good. So go back to design. And you can right click anywhere on this page. Go to page properties. And <coughs> you can put all your meta tags and descriptions and all that stuff right here in these uh, boxes. And you can put your keywords here and all that. And you click on the formatting, and you can actually add your background picture, which I'm just gonna I'm just gonna pick one. Uh, and you can click OK on that, and that's what the background is. Really ugly, so I'm gonna take it back off. But <coughs> what you want to do is make sure that background picture is in the same folder that your this page is in, which I don't have it that way. This is just showing you how to set the uh, background up. But I'm going to take it back out because I don't want it. And if you click on the watermark, make it watermark, that picture will stay put. It won't scale with the page or any, any of that stuff. Okay, so we're going to go over here to advanced. And you can do other stuff here. Set your language and all that stuff. Usually I don't fool around with all that stuff because uh, the defaults work pretty good. And this is pretty much, that's how you design your web page. And uh, you put your, <coughs> we're going to draw another layer in here. And you can make, uh, I'll make that a little bit smaller. And this is where the contact info, privacy policy, and all that stuff goes. Okay. And you can put your menu right here in this box if you want it. Uh, put ads over here to the right. 
So this could be an add or a uh, menu. <coughs> now notice that, let's say you've already copied uh, your your code for your ad or whatever you, you want to put here. You can just simply click up here at the top and you can go to code, then you can go to edit, paste, and you can paste that code. It'll end up exactly right there in that box where you want it. And then you can kind of play around with it, position it any way you want to. So, <coughs> okay. So, if we preview it, here's how it's going to look. So you kind of get the idea, just a basic, you know, basic layout of a web page. That's pretty simple to do. I may make more tutorials. I don't know. Um, if you enjoy this, consider a donation at my website. Uh, you go to the forums, and I have, <coughs> you know, many more cool tips and tricks there as well. Thanks for watching.